Managing insect pests is often facilitated by the efforts of natural enemies. Natural enemies or biocontrol agents are organisms that harm or kill insect pests. In sorghum, the sugarcane aphid has multiple common natural enemies that feed on it. One of the most important groups of natural enemies of the sugarcane aphid are parasitoid wasps like the one shown here. Eggs are injected into live aphids and emerging larvae feed on them from the inside out. In order to subdue aphids, a temporary paralyzing venom slows the aphids down. This venom wears off eventually and the aphids feed normally until the wasp is ready to pupate, at which point they kill the aphid. The dead aphid then turns a dark black or brown color. These aphids killed by parasitoids are called mummies. Adult wasps emerge from these lifeless husks and continue in the life cycle. Green and brown lacewings are also a group of beneficial insects. Adult lacewings feed on a variety of things, but the larvae have the greatest impact on aphids. Lacewing larvae feed on aphids by piercing the body with their sickle-shaped jaws. They then inject digestive fluids, which allow them to feed on the aphids. Some species of lacewing larvae are often covered in the corpses of dead aphids which they haul around. This acts as a defensive mechanism against other predators. Lacewing eggs are easily recognized because they are found individually on long, thin, silky stalks, which are often in a row. Surfid or hoverfly adults often mimic bees or wasps. The adults feed on honeydew and pollen. Surfid larvae look like small caterpillars without an apparent head. Though blind, these are voracious predators of aphids. Ladybugs or ladybird beetles are some of the most easily recognized natural enemies, but their larvae are typically not as well known. One of the most common species has larvae that are dark black with orange. One less recognized type of ladybug are those belonging to the skimnus group. These beetles are smaller than the other commonly recognized ladybugs. The larvae of this species looks like tiny fuzzy ovals. Others are small, gray, and hairless as shown here. Both the adults and the larvae of the ladybugs mentioned here feed on aphids. It is important for pest managers to be able to identify natural enemies. Being able to do so will help you decide whether to use pesticides or not. If a lot of natural enemies are present in a given area of your sorghum, you may consider delaying pesticide treatments. Overusing pesticides can harm natural enemy populations. Consult your local extension office for specific details on pesticide treatment timings and thresholds. Thanks for watching this episode. If you have any questions, please ask those in the comments and check out these other videos about sorghum pests or related topics and subscribe to our channel to stay tuned next time for all things insects.